This is the next question we have. It says at room temperature, a dilute solution of urea is prepared by dissolving 0.6 gram of urea in 360 gram of water. If the vapor pressure of pure water at this temperature is 35 mm of Hg, lowering of vapor pressure will be. These are the options given. Students, as we know, relative lowering vapor pressure is equal to the mole fraction of solute. So, we can write here P naught A minus P S upon P naught A is equals to number of moles of B by number of moles of B plus number of moles of A. Here A I have considered as solvent, B is solute. So NB is representing number of moles of solute, NA is representing number of moles of solvent. P naught is vapor pressure of pure solvent, PS is the vapor pressure of solution. So lowering in vapor pressure will be P naught A minus PS. As concentration of solute is very less, therefore it can be approximated to NB by NA. So, P naught A minus P S divided by P naught A. The value of P naught A is 35 is equal to number of moles of solute. It is 0 0.60 by molar mass of urea is 60 divided by number of moles of solvent. N A will be equals to 360 by 18. 360 divided by 18. So, we can solve here to get the value of P naught A minus P S and it will be 0 0.017 mm of Hg. So, the correct answer for this question will be option 2. Now, let us move to the next question. This is the next question we have. It says a gas undergoes physical adsorption on a surface and follows the given friendly adsorption isotherm equation x by m equal to k p to the power 0 0.5. Adsorption of the gas increases with first option is increase in pressure and decrease in temperature. Second option is decrease in pressure and decrease in temperature. Third option is increase in pressure and increase in temperature. Fourth option is decrease in pressure and increase in temperature. Students, if I talk about adsorption, extent of adsorption increases when we increase the pressure and it decreases when we increase the temperature. So, the correct answer should be we should increase the pressure and decrease the temperature for increasing the extent of adsorption. Hence, the correct answer for this question is option A where it is written increase in pressure and decrease in temperature. So, the correct answer is option 1. Now let us move to the next question. This is the next question we have. It says the synonym for water gas when used in the production of methanol is. Option 1 is fuel gas. Option 2 is syn gas. Option 3 is laughing gas. Option 4 is natural gas. Students, if coke reacts with steam in the presence of nickel catalyst at 1270 Kelvin. It gives us carbon monoxide and hydrogen gas mixture. This is called as water gas or this is also known as syn gas. Hence, the correct answer for this question is option 2. Now, let us move to the next question. 